All right, now I just wanted to say a few words here. And this is more for people who are new to the channel or maybe people who know me in real life, but come across the channel or someone sends them a clip or so on there. And they're, they're not quite sure what to make of it because they know me in real life. And, you know, like in my everyday life, I'm not going around talking about mass immigration the whole time. But on this channel, I have a lot of videos talking about mass immigration, you know. So that's, for some people, that's just not going to make sense. Why, why is Tomas going on about all mass immigration and what does he not like immigrants or is, is he does he have a problem with them or you know and this is the perception people will have you know and um it's it's a false perception obviously but but that's the perception that probably people who know me in real life would get if they came across this channel you know but this is the thing it's these are important issues and they do need to be spoken about and unfortunately because our system, if you like, our mainstream, haven't really been speaking about, you know, issues like mass immigration in any kind of objective way up until very recently. And they've been forced to do so really over the last, say, three to six months because of circumstances, you know, because the ordinary people have said, no, this is not acceptable. We will not accept, impose relentless mass immigration on our towns and villages, you know, without our consent completely transforming um, the character of, of our towns and villages, you know. Like, this is, just on a basic moral level, this is wrong, you know. And anyone, really, who's looking at the situation honestly and fairly should recognise that. But the problem is, we haven't had that balanced um, perspective on things coming from, we'll say, the power, people in power, whether that be in media or politicians or economists or cultural commentators and so on. So that's really why... That's really why I've been speaking about mass immigration quite a bit over the last um, number of months, especially on this channel. And I've moved from, you know, what this was previously, speaking about, you know, or videos about music and, and uh, travel and nature and so on. And now it's become mostly political. But, you know, I'm aware that, you know, I'm still interested in all those other things outside politics. And I don't really want this to be just a political channel. So I probably will, you know, pretty soon, I'd say, maybe once these elections are over, I'm probably going to, I'm probably going to make a lot of these videos private for the time being and just go back to this being a normal channel because, you know, in my real life, I am a normal guy. I'm not, I'm not um, obsessed with mass immigration. It's, it's, it's just, a, it's something that needs to be spoken about and it needs for ordinary voices, ordinary people to actually say, here's what is actually going on on the ground, you know, my opinions, the things I'm saying, are reflected by really hundreds of thousands of people across Ireland. You know, if you look at all the, in fact, even millions, if you look at all the polls, over, especially over the last, say, 9, 12 months, most people, you know, the majority of people in Ireland agree with the general sentiment of what I've been saying in these videos about mass immigration. You know, they might not agree with everything, with all the minute, but the general trust of what I'm saying the majority of Irish people, and probably not just Irish, but probably quite a few foreign people who live in Ireland would agree with, I would say, based on the polling that's been done over the last year or so. So this is what I'm getting at, you know. Um, these are important points. They need to be made. Some of them you know already. Some of them people maybe don't realise, you know. They might have some idea, but they haven't really heard it explained, you know, in a, in a more fuller way. Like that video about diversity candidates. It's not saying don't vote for people from diverse backgrounds you know or it's not saying people from diverse backgrounds are bad or anything like that it's simply saying recognize there are certain um behaviors that are innate and that come from our racial ethnic and cultural backgrounds okay like that's that's really just common sense but you're not really hearing anyone in the media coming out and saying that you know or even in the scientific world necessarily certainly not in the mainstream scientific world you know so so this is what I'm getting at. Um, 